and you know it, pet a dog. If you're happy and you know it, pet a dog. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, pet a dog. In the first year that we were here, May could tolerate maybe 20 minutes of it before she'd get overwhelmed. Oh, the first time is, is, is struggling to put her in that room. From the very beginning, she's not really like uh, into the dogs. She wouldn't go anywhere near them. She was throwing things. She was grabbing dogs away from other kids. She was just, it was chaotic. Me and my husband did not think that she was going to be walking the dogs and um, playing with them and brushing them and stuff, so, but we just kept at it. From the first year, two years ago until now, like now you feel like she just come in and then she know, like, okay. And she just started walking the dogs and it was just wonderful. The support of the library staff has made it possible. And I mean, it's across the board. Every librarian has, they, they know us. They're happy to see us. Oh, yes, you know how. And anything I ask for support, I get. They were wonderful with her. They sat there, they played a game with her on the floor. I didn't understand the science behind it, but they sure understood it. And now they have her walking an Irish setter this afternoon. <laughs> and instead of crying, she's smiling today. She's walking the dog. That's huge change. That's a big progress. I think it's just giving her more security to, you know, be able to bond with a dog because she doesn't speak very much. So there's some kind of um, closeness or some kind of special thing in between her and the dogs because of that. And it's just, it's growing and she's, this year she's saying more words. And, um, you know, from going through all these years too, I can see other children getting better as well, not just Angela. This has been such a gift. We are probably going to get a service dog ourselves. This is something that I've thought about for a few years. And seeing her with these dogs has helped me understand the value, first of all. Secondly, you know, there's a bunch of us parents out there that end up having this amazing support group that just kind of spontaneous support group. We sit out there, we talk to each other, we share tips. So even if it's not good for the kids, which it's awesome for the kids, it's this amazing chance for me to interact with other parents of kids with disabilities. And it's like a little family. The library needs to keep doing this and more of it.